six minutes into a fresh conditioning test same plates and I've already got brown beginning to form and it looks like it's developed into a scum hmm well when I take a spoon and move it around it acts almost like a gelatinous substance it might just be the foam is behaving like soap suds it sure leaves a film on the spoon though well at 12 minutes looks like I've got lots of scum uh, where there was lots of scum on the back side on the other side of the plates it appears to have dissipated a little bit also the bubbles the larger ones you can see them popping if you look real carefully so the scum's not impermeable although it seems to be preventing the small bubbles from popping now they're just over 30 minutes and the water has achieved 111 degrees and the brown scum hasn't really grown since it first started really to form it appears as though whatever's making it brown is just suspended in it I don't really know the nature of this stuff yet you will find it out but it's not all brown a little bit of it is lighter colored well, that might be oxygen production occurring below it I don't or gas production occurring below it I don't know yet so okay stopping the test other than the scum turning more and more brown all the time it hasn't really grown in size so I've got a feeling that uh, the scum is a different component than the color so what I'm going to do now I observe when I let it cool overnight that the scum goes into suspension and then as soon as you jar it it drops to the bottom so I'm going to try to document that after it cools so uh, within a couple of minutes it looks like the scum has dissipated and whatever is making it brown is already going into suspension not floating on the top but but hanging near the surface and disturbing it seems to cause it to sink so It'll be interesting to see what the scum itself is. Could it be the sodium is collecting carbon dioxide? I know that it's known for doing that. Is that a is that a result of it? I don't know. But interesting observation. Okay, it's been several hours and now the temperature is at 83 on the electrolyte. I didn't have enough light to do the job so I brought out the industrial excuse me the construction light and now we're going to take a look at this stuff see if there's enough light to see what we're doing I see scum and when you disturb it just 
by moving it around it sinks giving it a good knock does the same thing it's all dropping down into the bottom matter of fact it just looks like water now at the top let's see if this is scum like it was before no now it's behaving just like electrolyte